All right, today we're gonna clean this shop. It's a wreck, it's terrible. I built some bunk beds while well, I repainted them and put them all back together. But the shop is a disaster because we've been involved in several projects. So today we're gonna clean it up. Just a small preview. I mean, there's even a kid wandering around in here. We just got a lot to do. recently contacted by this company, Super Clean. They sent me an email addressed to my YouTube channel, which I have to admit was pretty cool. Kind of uh, makes you feel the slightest bit legitimate. And they asked if I would make some video of their product. No better time than the present. This is a aerosol version, degreaser cleaner. I have this all wheel cleaner. I've already tried this a little bit. It works pretty good. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna clean up this pile of transmission fluid and rear end of grease um, off my floor. This is almost embarrassing to show you, but it is a testament to why I need to replace that FMX transmission. And I'm going to, I've already made the decision. A Little bit of power steering fluid, some old grease back here, a little bit more ATF. spray down just kind of lightly with the spray it's got a pretty powerful odor don't breathe it if you can help it I followed that up with a rag with a little soap on it, it, it it's just clean it looks really good so I give that test thumbs up okay next test we're gonna use the aerosol can this one and we're gonna try to hit some of the grime the oil and stuff on this weed eater this can this also has the same kind of smell it's not a bad smell, but you can tell it's a powerful cleaner. So try not to suck it in. Okay, just for the heck of it, let's hit this motor one more time. Now the motor on my weed eater, little engine, I needed to do a little bit more down here, you know, hit it again, but it obviously took a lot of it off, but it cleaned it up pretty well. So in terms of oil and grease, I could use a little bit extra, it'll work. Okay, last test. I've got a pinion yoke that came out of my 74 rear end, the, the, the other one that we're not using. As you can see, that's pretty good. If you're gonna restore an old car or an old truck, this is the kind of stuff you're gonna run into, let's see how it does. I'm not trying to make this part perfectly clean. It's, a, it's basically a junk part, but it definitely helped me get a lot of that gunk off of it. So I'm not using this part, but it was grimy. I wanted you to see how it would do. Heck, I didn't know what it would do. Look how warped up it is. Yeah, that's pretty good, because that's, that's clean. I would say on this part right here, good job.
All right, here's a little bonus, bonus video. Super clean. I got my uh, AC compressor out of the Expedition, and rather than replace it, I want to see if we can fix it. But it's so terribly nasty, and I don't want to fool with it. I mean, look at my gloves. Just let's see how well the Super Clean will knock the grease off this compressor. There you go. Very, very minimal rubbing, brushing. I'm talking about the smallest amount. Um, that's pretty clean. My hands got real bad, I sprayed it with it. That stuff's no joke. That's clean. Okay, let me say once again, thank you to Super Clean for sending me these products to sample. I will definitely be using these I think it's really cool you reached out to my channel to allow us to do something like this. I can assure you, if you've ever cleaned up old parts like that, like that yoke, you know that something like this goes a long way. Good. This was good. I would definitely recommend that you give them a shot. Let's get back to cleaning up this disaster. I just don't want to get rid of this. There you go.